Good afternoon, everyone. My three new words today are the first one is sabotage, the second one is uh, decoy, the third word is ordain. So the example, I will explain the meaning of the of the word in English first, and then two examples following. So the first one is sabotage. If someone sabotages a plan or a meeting, they deliberately pretend it from being successful. So the first example I made here is he accused the opposition of trying trying to sabotage the election. The second example I made here is just in my reading. So the way the human brain works can sabotage our decisions. It means our brain will betray us sometimes. So the second word is decoin. If you refer something or someone as decoin, you mean that they are intended to attract people's attention and deceive them. It will make sense uh, to you in Vietnamese, in Vietnamese when I translate it into Vietnamese. Okay, the example I made here is the first one. He was booked a fly leaving that day, but that was just a decoy. Uh, the second uh, uh, example is just in marketing term. So this is, you have to think about it, okay? Um, it is important for the um, consumer. Uh, the first, sorry, in marketing, the coin effect the, is the type of pricing strategy that market marketers use to get you to switch your choice from one option to more to a more expensive one okay the third word is ordain when someone is ordained they are made a member of clergy in a religious ceremony okay it will make sense in vietnamese the first one is, he was ordained a Catholic priest in 1982. The second example is, eventually he was ordained at a Tibetan monastery in the Indian Himalayas. Himalayas. It's still very difficult for me, this one. Okay, that is for me today. See you tomorrow. Bye.